Yo guys, what is going on? It's Luki here and welcome back to another video. In today's video, I'm going to be going through the best MA41 class in Modern Warfare. Now this weapon is probably one of the best weapons in the game right now. Pretty much everyone is using this weapon and I'm just seeing so many people do well with this weapon. If you guys get into a lobby and there's that one guy on the other team that's completely shredding, then 9 times out of 10 he's going to be using this weapon. So if you guys have been thinking what gun is he using then it's most probably this gun. So in today's video I'm going to be giving you guys a best class up for that weapon. Anyway, before I get into the class setup, I'd like to quickly mention that me and Gibbonator are doing a Modern Warfare full game giveaway. All you gotta do to enter is subscribe to me, subscribe to him. His link will be in the description down below. And then go ahead and click the link to the Twitter tweet um, down below and in the description. And it'll take you to a tweet with all of the giveaway information. So make sure to go ahead and enter that if you guys wanna go ahead and try and win a free copy of Modern Warfare. We'll be announcing the winners nearer the release date of Modern Warfare. Anyway, without further ado, let's get into this M841 class up. Um, now, this weapon is very, very good, so I definitely recommend you guys using this class up. You guys will absolutely shred with it. So here it is up on the screen now. As you guys can see, I have stock, I have sleight of hand, which is the perk category of the attachments, which is pretty cool. In this game, you actually get an attachment for the perks on like your weapon. I have grip and I have a like, nice reflex sight on it. And then I have the breacher device as the muzzle attachment. Now the breacher device is a kind of you guys can go ahead and w use whichever one you guys want to but i thought i'd try this out because it's pretty cool and basically what it allows you to do is get one hit melee kills so if you guys are like if you guys run around a corner and all of a sudden there is an enemy there then it's actually very very helpful because you guys can basically panic melee if you guys remember from like black ops 2 days and all those previous call of duties then basically there was a thing called panic knife in where if you would come across an enemy and they were really close range to you you just quickly hit the melee button um and you guys would kill them pretty much most of the times because obviously you guys can just go ahead and quickly melee and in one hit they'll be dead and it was very very useful to be fair like like I said before, most times it would be used, for example, if you run around a corner and there is an unexpected enemy there and you basically are arms lip uh, whip away from them and you guys can just go ahead and melee them and there we go, like you would literally kill them straight away. So it's a very, very good attachment. The next attachment I'm using on this gun is going to be the reflex sight. Now the iron sights on this weapon are okay, but personally I would definitely go ahead and use a reflex sight on it. And the stock basically allows you to stray from left to right and basically this will let you avoid uh, enemies bullets so if you get into a one-on-one -on -one gunfight and you and the enemy are shooting at each other then if you guys use stock you guys can actually shoot whilst moving to the left and to the right and it's actually very very helpful because you guys can avoid their bullets and you guys can be moving while shooting them and it can kind of put them off quite a lot to be fair because they're not going to expect you to be moving like a lot like to the left and to the right so it's going to really mess up their accuracy and you guys are going to be able to win a lot more gunfights with that stock so i definitely recommend you guys giving it a go now the next attachment i used on this weapon is the full grip now the full grip basically just allows you to get a better accuracy with this weapon it reduces the recoil and all of that kind of stuff now the recoil on this game there is quite a lot of recoil on pretty much most of the weapons so it's very very handy to have a uh any kind of foregrip on your weapon now in this game there is a few different foregrips uh, basically some foregrips let you have reduced recoil from the horizontal and then some of them make your vertical recoil less as well so you guys have to just pick whichever guys whichever you guys want to personally i'd go ahead and pick the um vertical one just because that is basically the up and down one and that is probably where the recoil happens the most so i definitely recommend you guys using that one instead of the other one that is just my choice though, you guys can of course use whatever you guys want to. And the last thing I use on this weapon is going to be sleight of hand, which basically lets me reload quicker. And that is very, very helpful just so I can go ahead and reload fast and I don't have to worry about reloading slowly in gunfights. Anyway, that has been it for today's video. Hopefully you did enjoy it. If it did, please go ahead and drop a sub and a like. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.